I'm John Vitas, joined today with FGCU senior Christian Tyrell. First of all, Christian, thanks for coming in today. No, we appreciate no it. No problem. Now, you're going to give us a little inside look at the f- new facilities mm-hmm. here at Alico Arena. You get a chance to use these every single day. So, first of all, we're here in the, the offices uh, in the beautiful new lobby. Um, when you first saw this room and, and all the new renovations, what were your first thoughts? I thought it was amazing. Um, we can use it as a recruiting tool in this, this uh, where you first walk in and the uh, film room and the uh, the um, training center is awesome. Should we take a look? We should. And right behind us right here is the entrance to the film room. So when was this completed? When did you guys get a chance to first um, use it? Right at the beginning of the school year it was finished. Yeah. So how often are you guys in here and how often do some of the other teams come in and look at some film for, for upcoming um, We're opponents? here almost every day in here for probably not, not too long, 20 minutes. Um, women's basketball is in here a lot. So we're a couple days out from the Illinois State opener. Uh, take me through your schedule throughout the week and how these facilities come in handy for you. Uh, well, today we're going to watch film on them, on their offense, so we can get a feel for it and so we can guard it in practice. And then um, after practice, we'll probably watch some of our clips on defense and uh, stuff like that. And then throughout the week, we're just going to keep doing the same thing until the final, uh, right before the game, the day before the game, we'll watch probably about an hour on, on their stuff and how we're going to guard it, stuff like that. Let's take a look downstairs. Oh, definitely. Well, now we're in the hydrotherapy room here with Christian Terrell of FGCU Basketball. How often do you guys use this? Um, I'm in here every day, mostly, mostly for the hot tub, which is right there. So this is a post-practice recovery room for you guys. Yeah, and uh, I use it before practice for the hot tub to get loose and uh, stretch out a little bit. But yeah, the cold tub is for uh, post-practice. And all the athletic teams have access to this, right? Yes, yes they do. Um, Everybody can come in here and uh, do whatever they feel they need. And this is obviously the first year you've had this. Have you felt the difference physically? Oh yeah, definitely. You can just come in here and uh, hop in whenever you want. Last year we had the individual cold tubs and we only had a few of them, so it was always busy. So um, we come in here and do whatever we want. Awesome. One last stop. We're now on the academic side here with Christian Terrell taking a look at the study hall room. This is where you guys do a lot of your studying. How important was it to have this space available to you? It's been awesome for us, really. It's been a lot of uh, extra room that we have to uh, get our study hall in. Last couple of years, we've had a small area to do everything, so it got loud and got crowded. And now we have individualized uh, study hall rooms to our, to our left over here, and behind us we have the computers. And uh, yeah, it's just been great. We have a lot more uh, access to the, um, for the resources to uh, be able to study. Now, talking about the upcoming season a little bit, you, you guys had another 20-win season last year, bringing mm-hmm. in more talent this year. What is mm-hmm. the potential of this group? Uh, hopefully, we're not just satisfied with getting into the NCAA tournament. We want to win some games, and um, yeah, that's our goal. Christian Tyrell, thank you so much for no showing problem. us around. We appreciate it. No problem.